हाई गाइज वेलकम बैक टू आर यूट्यूब चैनल सो एज इन दिस वीडियो वी विल सी यू रे पैक पूल हीटर रोल आउट एस डब्ल्यू ओपन एंड हाउ टू फिक्स इट सो गैज इफ यू आर फेसिंग दिस इशू वी हैव फ्यू स्टेप्स दैट यू कैन फॉलो टू रिजॉल्व सो गैज फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल यू हैव टू मेक श्योर दैट यू टर्न ऑफ द हीटर एंड डिसकनेक्ट द पावर सप्लाई इट इज सिंपली अ सेफ्टी मेजर सो यू डोंट गेट हर्ट इन दिस प्रोसेस एंड देन अनदर स्टेप दैट यू हैव टू डू इज Inspect the rollout switch. Locate the rollout switch on your heater, usually near the burner's assembly. In more mo in so many models, so make sure which uh, model that you are using, and then <coughs> locate the rollout switch. Check if the switch has tripped. It's a safety device that cuts off the heater if it senses excessive heat. Okay, and then reset the rollout switch if it uh, was tripped. If uh, the switch has tripped, you can try resetting it. Some models have a manual reset button on the switch. Press the reset button. If it clicks, it means that the switch has tripped. Switch was tripped. Okay, guys. And then examine the burner area. Remove any panels necessary to access the burner compart compartment. And then look for debris, shoot, build up, uh, or blo blockages that make us poor airflow or overheating. And then, guys, check for proper ventilation. Ensure that there is no obstruction in the venting system, and block vents can trap heat, triggering the rollout switch. and then inspect the heat exchanger look for signs for shoot corrosion or skill build up on the heat exchanger if necessary clean the heat exchanger to improve heat transfer and the airflow and then guys <coughs> examine the gas pressure and flame check the burner flames to ensure there are blue and steady yellow or irregular flames could indicate improper gas pressure or dirty burners and then guys you can also contact a professional to adjust the gas pressure if needed if you have no knowledge about it simply call a professional to help you with it and then guys replace the roll out switch if you think that um you have to roll out uh, replace your roll out switch and it is not going to work anymore so just uh re replace it with a new roll out switch of the same rating as per the manufacturer's specification and then test the heater reassemble the panel turn the power back on test the heater to ensure it is functioning properly without triggering the rollout switch so guys i hope this video helps you thanks for watching